Now, the madness singer Suggs is one of the celebrities, including Danny Boyle, backing a plan to create a sculpture trail through East London. The trail aims to link the Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park and the O2 with a walkway of up to 30 modern and contemporary sculptures. There's no public funding for this project, so a crowdfunding campaign is being launched to find the money to pay for it. Well, with me now is the lead singer of Madness, Suggs, although that's not why you're here. You're here to talk about sculpture. Um, tell us a bit more about this sculpture walk. What's it going to look like? Well, it's going to look like the most amazing thing possibly London has ever seen. It's going to be 30 sculptures. They're all going to be along the water side of the, of the canals and, and riverside of, of East London. As you've already st said, starting at the Olympic Village and ending up, in fact, ending up in the Greenwich, Greenwich Peninsula. Um, including that funny old um, cable car that no one seems to really know where it goes to or from. It, that will now have a purpose as well. But there's a young friend of my daughter's actually called Megan Piper, who's a very um, um, enthusiastic and um, rather incredible person who's come up with this idea. And, and it was firstly to see sculpture outdoors. So, so this is not, you don't have to go to a museum to see this art. It also involves a very nice walk. And it will also involve people um, presenting their own work to the committee that will then choose the stuff that goes on display. And that's people from all over the country can enter their own sculptures to this idea. Yeah. Um, and is that how you got involved, through your daughter? Well, through my daughter's friend, Megan, who, who, who yes, yeah, is a very, um, very um, exciting person in, in the world of art at the moment. But why um, did you want to Well, also, you know, because I know that, that that part of London was not most, you know, it's, it's still in the process of being regenerated. Um, I'm a, big, I'm a big fan of art in general, and um, I just thought it was such a stimulating and fascinating idea. You know, you know, ideas come to you when you feel they're exciting to you personally, and I would love to do this walk. I mean, I think walking around the canals of London is a great thing. Anyway, can you imagine if you walk and pass some really great art at the same time? And just to talk to you about how it's going to be funded, because mm. it's going to cost what? The first phase is going to be about £140,000, and um, there's a crowdfunding site called um, Space Hive, um, and people can donate anything from two pounds upwards. So, you know, and I think that's not a huge amount of money to, to get something that could be one of the most extraordinary things of the last who knows how long in London. We were seeing pictures there of Danny Boyle, the film director, who I know is involved as well. Crowdfunding, I'm not sure how everybody will understand exactly how that works. Yes. You just donate your money, is that right? Yes, you go to spacehive.com and um, the line, and you donate as much as you wish. I mean, the thing about Spacehive is they are doing things that are more art, based and socially based. Um, there are some other sites that are purely to make money, but this is certainly not the case for this one. Um, but I'd, I'd recommend everyone to go and have a look if you have any interest in art. I think you'll find it a very interesting... And very, very briefly, when are you hoping it might be open, if all goes to plan? Well, you know, it could be open this summer. That's the most amazing thing. It's all set up to go. It really just needs that bit of push of an extra bit of cash. And, you know, the Mayor of London and a lot of other people have shown interest, but they're not putting any money in just yet. So we're hoping that the ball gets rolling. It'll also get a bit of money from... Uh, more of the sort of uh, powerful people of this country. OK, well, look, come back in and tell us how you get on. I certainly will. <laughs> All right, for I'm now. I'm sure I'll be back. Suggs, thanks very much You're indeed. You're very welcome.